Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. And in this video, we'll be playing a new game, Solar Smash. So, in the previous episode, we actually played Minecraft and we made another portal. But today, I'm going to try a new different game, not Minecraft, but Solar Smash, as you can see. In this game, basically, we have to smash the solar system or the planets in it and for that we having a lot of weapons right here so in today's video we will be testing some powerful weapons to destroy our planet earth as you guys can see so first up is an asteroid Mm, so let's just put it there and let's see how many people can that kill not even one single guy I guess I didn't hit it at the right spot let's see what happens when you hit it at a populated place ninety six million oh god that's a lot now let's just reset the planet and then let's try our next weapon up and our next weapon up is also some kind of stone maybe meteoroids Whoa, that's a lot of damage, guys. 501 million. That's something very large. What happens when you destroy the whole earth? Let's destroy the other half side. That weapon is very, very powerful. Moving on to the next. Why am I speaking like a host on a show? Uh, okay, guys. So next what we have is our own moon hitting the earth let's just target it here because so that place is already so much destructed so let's see what happens when he hit it with the earth i mean the moon to the earth did it just make a hole right through the earth no, it didn't make a hole on the back side though. Still the hole is not complete so let's just send another moon. Because I want to make a hole. Oh, there's a little hole right there. The moon also gets destroyed. Well that's obvious so... What if I send another moon right there so that the two moons can collide? If I come here and send another moon. Oh god, that's a great damage. And our earth seems no more to be a habitat for human beings. So let's just reset the planet. Next, we are having, this is some kind of a black hole, I guess. And now if I click it there. So yes, guys, next up is our black hole. Let's see how much damage does 
the black hole do to the earth? Seven hundred and eighteen million people have died. Mm, by the way, it's better than the single asteroid. It actually does a lot of damage. And I don't know why I am up to damaging my own planet. So let's just change the planet and a custom planet we will try that but not in this episode guys so for now let's just try destroying the venus uh, so here's our venus but there are no people on venus so it's basically we cannot calculate how much damage does the weapon do so basically earth is the best planet to destroy so now comes our next weapon this one looks like some lightning or thunder um, let's just try it out and see how much damage it does Oh my goodness, I swear I just clicked one time over here, just one time and 2 billion and 889 million people have died. Seriously, I'm just clicking one time, I'll just reset the world and try again. I click it there and then my mouse is away. I'm not clicking anything. Oh god, that is the deadliest weapon up till now. All these are nothing in front of this thunder. What happens if we destroy the whole earth to its core? There's nothing, exactly nothing left over here. Just looks like a huge asteroid right now. The earth is gone. Um, why don't we just finish it up like fully, not even the core should be left. That's literally nothing left out there. So, okay guys, I guess that's it for today's video. If you like this video, please leave a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, subscribe. And if you want me to make a new episode of this game, then leave five likes on this video when I make the next episode in which we'll be trying new types of weapons. There are missiles, there are bombs, some alien weapons, some animal stuff and all. And if you want me to try it out, then leave a uh, five likes on this video and I am going to make the next episode very, very soon. So, okay guys, that's it and bye.